I uh, I, uh, I got my I got my little focus here, so I'm uh, I'm ready ready to uh, ready to hack those machines. And I also, uh, I found a larger I found a larger Santa hat, and now I'm I'm all uh, I'm all cozied up, nice and warm. Hope you've been having a good day, Aurora. And it's Friday, so y'all know what that means. Horizon Zero Dawn. So if I remember correctly, where we left off. Um, we finished one of the, the main, it was in main quest, it still felt like a side quest of a, of a, of a arsonist trying to destroy this city. It's been, I feel like I've been on a adrenaline caffeine rush for the last 48 hours. Um, I don't know. I, I I feel really really energized um, from from all the all the all the support and love I've gotten from y'all uh, since I had affiliate. Um, if uh, if you notice, we we already unlocked another emote. So uh, the only thing appropriate was putting Drecky Sob in there because fucking I was crying up a storm. <laughs> Also had a, a kind of a unhinged impromptu stream last night, um, testing out a couple things. Broke my broke my sounds, but I think I fixed them today. Added a couple, added a couple new things. Trying out some stuff. But all right, uh, let's see. Um, what are we at? What's my quest? Grave Horde. U.S. Robot. Oh, right, right, right. We learned... Um, we learned that Horizon Zero Dawn was some kind of project that stopped the, um, Grey Goo Apocalypse event. Yeah, I was... Again, I've been just running on a pure caffeine... And adrenaline high. Uh, my my sleep schedule is uh, uh, it's, it could be better, but uh, <laughs> but that's that's what the coffee's for, right? <laughs> uh, but uh, I feel like I've been doing I've been getting a lot of a lot of stuff I've wanted to do. I've been getting done. I'll find usually, for you. usually there's like ten things I want to do in a day, and I only get like two of them done because of uh, executive dysfunction or ADHD or whatever it might be. Ooh. Animal talisman skull. I don't think we've gotten one of those before. Yeah, it was, uh, it was just a little bit of a uh, little bit of plate up. Um, we're thinking of, thinking of doing some, uh, some, seeing if we can do, like, some, some speed running on a lark. They're certainly a lot better than me. So it was a lot of them teaching me how to, uh, play the game, and then a lot of just late night ridiculousness. Uh, played up. Um... So Played Up is, you're sort of like running a restaurant kind of thing, um, with some little goobers. And, uh, it only goes like 15 days, or levels, basically. And so it's like from, from the start of your restaurant through 15 days as fast as possible. Um, apparently like the two-person categories are not... It's not a huge... Speedrunning scene. Oh, Shiza! I didn't notice there was robots. But it just seemed like something that might be kind of fun. Don't mind me. I'm just uh, running on this way. Where's my objective? Ah, still that way. I haven't... 
The only other thing I've done speedrunning is I've actually speed ran um, Valkyrie Profile, the original, um, a couple times. I never submitted a run. You'll do. Um, even though um, in the last year they've opened the category up to uh, emulators, not just um, physical. Um, I would like to. I would like to get at least a somewhat decent time before I submit on it. But uh, I've been. I've been too busy to uh, practice or even get that up. I don't think I've even fired up the game in a good. Uh, good year or so. I'd have to reread all my route notes and they were particularly um, hieroglyphic. Uh, I need more arrows. Cross code. Got their attention? I feel like I know what that is. Is that like, uh, uh, wasn't that a kind of a cyberpunky game? No, I think I'm mixing it up with something that's like freeze something or another. Clab. Burb. No. Nope, don't see me. Don't see me, I'm invisible. I'm invisible. Shit, they saw me. Uh, what were they weak to again? Fire. Right. Let's just do fire arrows. Where the hell are they? the hell? Oh right, the crab. Oh shit, that's a lot of uh, robots. Concerning, concerning. Oh, I am not doing so hot. Oh, I'm not doing so hot. Yeah, I just got done dealing with, I want to say, like, what, seven of these damn things in the, uh, the quest I finished last time. Here we go again. Alright, uh, looks like I lost aggro. Wow, D&D 2.5? Unless you meant 3.5. Whoa, did they do, like, a scan? That's crazy. Okay, um, where is my map? I need to go... I would... I really should... One of them... Scrapper... Is... I think Scrapper is the one I can ride? Back to your business. No. Let me, let me, uh, let me do a little, little sneaksy here. Oh, it's, it's isometric. I think is what you mean. Like, uh, like Final Fantasy Tactics Advance, or Tactics Original. Come on. Right, I can't write it, uh, Hacking it just makes it fight. Whatever, it'll distract for me. Do do do, don't mind me, just causing chaos. Do do do. Quab. I definitely don't want to deal with a quab. Don't see me. No, it saw me! Alright, quab. I want shield breakers. Ooh, you missed. You missed. Oh, it did. 
didn't miss that time. Oh, that was a that was a one two three combo. Ah, the birds, the birds and the crabs. They've allied. Whee! Maybe if I get outside their range. Nope, the birds are still gonna bug me. Two fire should ground it. Go for critical. And the uh, the crabs are trying to take back, take back the land. Helpful. I mean, I've heard uh, seafood is full of heavy metals, you know, maybe this is just the, the natural, natural progression. Build up enough heavy metals and then they have a, uh, have a shell. Alright, I remembered how to use my items. So I need to replenish my medicine pouch. Don't mind me. Just a little tippy toe. Probably need to wait for this guy to assassinate. Right, they run away. <laughs> um, did you did you hear the uh, the blood sound effect? By the way, just to just to make sure I fix the alerts. Oh, why is it suddenly an emote only chat? Or am I crazy? My thing is showing it's an emote only, but you're not saying in emotes. I'll just chalk that up to uh, browser silliness. Definitely not sub only. I don't have anything that should be setting it to sub only. Or rather, I do have a thing that would set it to sub only, but it'd be very Risky obvious if I hit it. Is the good old panic button. All right. Oh, nah. For a few minutes, anyway. I just want to continue on with the main quest. Nah, nah. See, see, watch. See, see if you hit hydrate. Tr tr just try and spam it. Just try. It's not Fiji water. Um, it is legally distinct, non-copyright infringeable DG water. Very common mistake. <laughs> I don't know how to stop swimming. There we go. Oh, ram bots. Leave me alone. Probably weak to fire. Probably weak to being hit. 
too. No, I fell back in the oh, river. Oh boy. Please get out. Alloy. Alloy, please. There we go. You know what? Yeah, run away. Oh, my God. I do want to get some of my own. I mean, it's, there's a never ending list of, of improvements and things I want to add. I'm thinking of getting a, a, a bottle of water, some kind of, since I've been running with my internet connection is from uh, Atlantis, maybe some artisanal bottled salt water from Atlantis. <laughs> These are something special. Metal flower. Oh, it's a collectible. Nope. Actually, what does it say? Trade sets of them to Meridian. Yeah, I'm. I'm, all, I'm okay, Haas. Ooh, ooh. Oh, that sound effect. Oh, I love that. The, uh, the, when you're stepping on that fresh powdered snow, and it makes that crunching, compacting noise. Ooh, yes. Me like you. No, you can't see me. I'm invisible. God, fucking birds. Oh, there's one behind me! They baited and outsmarted me! Oh! Oh, gosh! Oh, they got... They got me. Damn, Aloy, you gotta look up, Beryl! They're coming in from above! Uh, they win this round. Thankfully, uh, that never happened, and uh, we just woke up from a nap. Actually, I should take a moment to appreciate the scenery. See, now that that's interesting. That is a very large, what looks to be a machine. All along the mountainside. Man, that uh, that really makes me want to reread um, Blame. Yeah, it's got like little tentacle arms, so it's like a giant octopus. But um, Blame is a really interesting cyberpunk um, manga. They know I'm here now. The author. Or artist, author slash artist, writer artist, um, does really amazing scenery like that. And I distinctly remember, um, it's like, throughout the manga, it's sort of following a guy as he's trying to climb through this ever shifting, ever building machine cityscape that is just constantly growing and changing. There's always one, like, you know, sometimes mangas, they have that, they have that double page picture full spread to show off certain scene. And there's one where it's basically, um, you see just the character is a tiny speck on the page. And there's this massive spherical, like, void with all these, um, blocky, metal textures built around the void, and then you just see the character Benshin that was Jupiter. And it just gives you this sense of scale that this superstructure he's going through, and he's been walking through for basically thousands of years, literally spans the solar system. 
and is just uncontrollably expanding from there. How did I take damage? Oh, we got some chuckle bucks. Is there someone behind me shooting me too? Or is it just, oh, that guy. I shoot faster than you, bruv. Fastest sniper in the west. Or north. It is pretty snowy. I have not seen a metal serpent yet. I feel like if we go into some tunnels, there might be some tunnelers. That's the only thing I can think of. But I mean, there were basically alligator, um, robo alligators, so. Robotic reptiles should be in the cards. Um, I don't think so, because it seemed like it had like a a head and there's a bunch of arms. In the shadow of a metal devil. Great. It makes me think of like the um the robots from Matrix, but like, you know, bigger. <gasps> Ouch. <sighs> They're inside too. That uh, that alarm sound effect that was in that audio file brings back me, memories. Oh shoot, those guys weren't dead. I have made several mistakes. You can take Nice friendly fire, bud. All right, that was that was a waste of perfectly good uh, heavy arrows. I think it's I think it's like what is that? What do I? What game do I remember that sound effect from? Oh, I know, 007, Goldeneye, back on the N64. Yeah, that's what it was. Titan inbound, same play as Akron. Base defense locks it down. We engage, sever the limbs, blast out the fountains. Another day in the life. Rockets are very close. Not be on point. Are you getting this, Silence? Silence? Huh. So I guess the um, the giant things were the uh... enduring victory. What did that mean? Whatever it was, it doesn't seem to have turned out very well. Seems like these are the the machines that we saw advertised that are like walking walking factories. They're probably the ones that went amok. Um. Oh, I could slide down this? Or I could almost die. You know, that's cool too. Huh. 
How do I... Do I just drop down? Let me... How do I let go? Aloy, let go! Okay, maybe I have to climb up? Okay, I'm back to where I was. Can I slide down this? No? Alright, so I do need to go down. Ah! Alloy! Come on. You can't just Assassin's Creed yourself, alright? Work with me here. Work with me! Yeah! Yeah, I did get down. Um, I prefer my bones in one piece, or... What is it, like 314 pieces rather than um, dust? At least I don't have to uh, fight all those people in death. So let's. Alloy. Woman, please. <laughs> I like how I, when I asked, when I jumped trying to grab the pipe and slide, I landed just fine. But now that I'm intentionally trying to climb down, she just decides running directly off the cliff Operation and snapping both her victory. femurs is the best move. What did that mean? Whatever it was, it doesn't seem to have turned out very well. Oh, it looks like an ad is about to start. I'll probably figure out how to climb down by the time it ends. Yes, you have subtracted the ads. Always the best move in uh, MMOs. I really need to get... I need, to, I need to probably think of a spiel so I don't get caught with my... get, with, get caught with my scales down whenever ads come up. So I'm gonna have something, something to say. That's the thing, I'm... Down, space, control, shift. And like, there's this area, but it doesn't let me go to it. And just hop over? No? Yeah, she just doesn't want to let go. Alloy, the ground is right there. Please. Please. Alright, let me just try hugging certain walls and mashing space. Or I can just jump down. No, she grabbed the wall! Hold on. Let me get back to that spot. Okay. You know what? Slag it. I'll take it. It got us off the bloody wall, and we're alive. What do we have here? I would have been so miffed if that was, like, electrified water and I immediately died. Al alloy? 
please. Girl. <sighs> Not off to a great start today. A lot of uh, controls fighting me here. Yeah, I, I, I cannot bloody win, it seems. I saw yellow, so obviously we gotta climb up this. have been where the soldiers slept. Like the Lodge in Mother's Heart, I guess. Log. First battle of the Eastern Seaboard Wall. Had a long run up to it. This was before Kalmar. And projections were a lot worse for the East. For three weeks, we kept getting scrambled out to some coastal burb to train Minutemen. It was always raining on account of Europe already being torched. Block after block of prefab barracks. They were still printing barracks right up until the hour the main force hit. The Minutemen? We ran combat drills with them in the streets where they'd lived, trying to pretend they might live to die somewhere else if they paid attention. Nothing worse than the ones who actually bought into it. Hopeful, pestering us with questions about Zero Dawn, like we know something they don't. I swear, the more we do this, the more like the bots we are. Except they learn from every fight. Us? I'm not so sure. Huh. And I think there was another audio log. Hello? Hello? Log. Third Battle of California Marine. The swarm came in from the Pacific, and I don't know if it was the local Minutemen or the crazy 15th, but they'd set the garbage patch alight. Man, the sea was on fire. That stuff was pretty. The first wave of bots came in covered in burning place? sludge. They bought us an hour or two of slaughtering them on the beaches before the swarm recalculated. We pulled them inland, back through the Kalmar sprawl. Dropped buildings on them, EMP'd the grid. Standard operating procedure. <sighs> the last time I was in California, I was... Five, six? The light was like that vintage social net filter that was everywhere in the 40s. Interesting. So they did use EMPs. The furnishings were metal. How'd they ever get comfortable? It was the metal world. I guess they were used to it. So it seems like EMPs alone were not enough. Like the robots were either shielded or managed to come back from them. Come back from the EMPs. Hmm. Just one bed. Maybe their war chief's room. barely see that one. Alright, where's our quest marker taking us? Let's see, did I... I think I go down? Yeah, I gotta go down. Look out below! Alloy, you died twice yeeting yourself off. Don't... Don't make light of this situation, alright? You do not have a good history with judging falling distance.
It is fascinating how well they've like designed the rock and mineral deposits slowly overtaking these metal areas. Ooh. These wires must run to the power source. Power cables. All right, I'm probably gonna have to do Red some light. kind of puzzle. Guess that means no power. Useful information. Shows the settings for nearby hollow locks. All right, how do I get over there though? Huh, leap of faith! Okay. I haven't seen one of these since I was a little kid. There must be some kind of code. Maybe I should try scanning objects in this area. Up, down, left, right. Up. Down. Left. Right. Three power lines. Three sources. That makes one. Easy. Um. Oh, there's more of them. I see. Oh, I gotta press C to let go. And hopefully next time I don't do it in a place that kills me like that. Alright, that one was on me. I can't blame you for that one, Alloy. I wonder if I can do it without scanning it. There must be some kind of code. Up, down, left, Maybe right. Maybe I should try scanning objects in this area. Three power lines. Resource. Yep. Oh, that's informative. Ow. Okay, this one looks to be up, up, down, down. Alright, why did they put the rotation on the same keybind as use medicine pouch? Oh, there was a ladder I could have taken down. Whoops. Once again, the fool is me. Error detected, consult G tech. Hey, y'all wanted to know how I remember the geotherm system reboot? goes like this. The bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. Didn't expect to hear nature's poetry from the lips of Mike the GT Tech now, did you? As usual, I defy expectations. No, wait, I need... Hey, y'all wanted to know how I remember the geotherm system reboot? Goes like this. Bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. East, Didn't west, expect to hear south. nature poetry from the lips of Mike the GT Tech now, did you? As well, thank you, Mike. Okay, I did it. Sounds like I did it. All right. Now to make our way back up without dying. I mean, yeah, I could have brute forced it. It's only um. Let's see, how, what is it? Four to the, is it N to the N minus one power combinations? So four to the three would be 16, 60, 66 possible? No. Yeah, 66 I think possible combinations. Um, hmm. I feel like I'm not remembering the formula exactly right. Regardless, it wouldn't have wouldn't have taken too long. Must 
Oh, it's a, uh... It's a high school metal band. Well, what do I do with it? I shouldn't talk shit. I had some friends who, who played. Who were in a band! That is a lot of people I'm gonna have to kill. Blaze canister, weak to fire. Ooh, I can detonate them. Got him. Are you serious? This is it for you. That is a machine gun. Uh, run, 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 get out of here. Get out, get out, get out. Get out. not the best way to open it at that. Actually, what I should... Well, no, that's corrupted. I don't think I can hack the corrupted walker. I think I need to focus on the... Um, I think I, yeah, I think I need to take out that minigun guy. Thug, dredger, dredger, heavy. I need to kill the heavy. Punisher, Sniper, Thug, Dredger. Okay, so I think the Heavy stays where they are. I'm wondering if there's any way I can sneak and get some stealth kills. Especially on, like, this... This Dredger over here is, like, in a room by himself. So I think I can maybe sneak out... I just need to wait for nobody to be looking this direction. I feel like that Punisher might also be pretty strong because it, he does have elite right. in his name. They're not looking for answers, just weapons. Yeah, there we go. Doing a little, doing a little Ezio now. I can time it right. Okay, as soon as the robot passes me, I think I can sneak over to that area over there. And it looked like there was a sort of a overhang I could crouch through and get up behind uh, this heavy. I need these people to stop me looking my way. You see nothing. You see nothing. There we go. God. Thank you for the boops. Okay. Oh, come on! All right, that was a whole lot of bollocks. Slag this. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna ninja the one dredger, and we're just gonna go blazing. It's them, all right. They're not looking for answers, just weapons. 
something there. worked out well. No, 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 grenade! Okay, that did not work out well. That that part worked out poorly. Oh my gosh. Missing point blank, that's embarrassing. I guess so. The Deathbringer gun. Hey, buddy. Bye, buddy. Man, I could eat like 30 of those bullets. That dude dropped in two. I don't know what Alloy's been eating, but uh, she got that, she got that iron skin. Save these for the trail. I kind of want, I kind of want to get that, that item pickup sound effect. I kind of want to use that. The boom. Um, were there anything I'm missing? There is a supply crate over there, so waste not, want not. Shedding. Um, let's see. Gotta go up here. Over here. A little bit of parkour, but no! No, no, no! Oh, mm hmm. You got me, Alloy. You, uh, you almost got me there. Uh, uh. Thanks for the mails, you. Time goes fast on active duty. Four months with the wreck and recalls. Fighting with these civilian enlistees. Scrappy guys and gals. That's all coming together. Between us and the 6th MRB, we took down a horse. I hope you made the news, honey. Showed everyone we're turning this around. We just need to give Project Zero Dawn the time it needs. Okay, so Project Zero Dawn is something that took a while. I know it's been days, honey. I'm so sorry. Deployments are getting real long. We have to put in for work for everyone. Like a family business. I still see you in the eyes of the people out there. They were glad to see us. They still had hope. I'm still fighting for you. Fuck. Oh man, the way his voice kind of cracked there. Oh shit. I don't like, I don't like where this is going. Where's number three? Where's number three? Gotta play them in order. Hold on. This was Sergeant Guliev. So added in approved two. Lieutenant. 
So Sergeant, oh no. Oh no, no, no. Status report. Ninth Mechanized Response Brigade, Commanding Officer Lieutenant Fiona Morrell. Unit morale continues to be adversely impacted by outbound engagements against the Pharaoh Plague. Especially when said engagements occur in sectors where civilian guard enlistees have been heavily engaged. The scope and nature of fatalities suffered by civilian guard and unarmed civilians in these sectors defy description. And witnessing it is generating a pervasive sense of hopelessness in the unit. Accordingly, I once again request that deployments of the 9th MRB be temporarily refocused on facilities that are mission critical to Project Zero Dawn. And once again, I request an immediate update on the status of Project Zero Dawn's timeline. Oh man, because like, at this point the machines are using biomass to replicate. So if they're going into, into civilian population centers, they're just, oh that would be awful. It, it, I imagine it would be like seeing a person being put into a wood chipper that spits out more robots. Just, yeah, that would that would obliterate morale. Oh, but this I think this is Guliev's. I don't even know if you're alive anymore. The mails I get from you, they say they're from you, but they don't sound. They sound recycled phrases put together and you don't say anything about the news i pass on the containment zone the rebreathers the rioting one earth what happened in the dallas bubble aims that wasn't the robots they won't even give me a straight answer when i demand to know if you're still alive they just say if your messages keep coming then you're still operational it's not fair aims it's not fair that you won't be with me when the lights go out. I love you. That's so sad. Ames, I know I mail you too much. I'm just proud of what you're doing. Everyone back home is. We got moved inland 10 kilometers, just as a precaution, they say. School's still in session, so I get to keep my eye on Andrus and Reggie. We never know where or when you're fighting. But when the VTOLs go over, all the kids run out and wave. I believe in you. I know nothing's ever going to be the same, but I believe in you. I believe in us. Okay, 